Just today, let me see the days of high. Are you shy? You know, are you a bit embarrassed? Are you not sure? Do you know about it? You're like, what are you talking about? I mean, so I see most of you actually don't really know about it. I just want to give you a quick introduction to it. If you want to come and you want to know more, please come and speak to myself. I'll tell you a lot more about it. But the anointing materials we have available, it is the backfire by fire oil, it is the prayer mantle, and we also have the oil for favor, uh, for blessings. We also have the uh, oil for breakthrough, as well as healing and protection. Amen. So we have that available in the house of the Lord. I want you to grab hold of the anointing materials. If you don't have them, get your hands on them. Amen. The anointing can be transferred to anything. The anointing can go from a man. It can go onto another man. It can go from a physical item onto another physical item. Amen. So God has blessed us with his anointing, which is carried on the devices, being the oil would be the um, anointing, the mantle, prayer mantle, which is, amen. So on that, the anointing is carried. So you can take it with you. You can take it home with you. You can lay it on that stubborn husband. You can lay it on that stubborn boss. You can lay it wherever you want to lay it. You can lay the anointing down. Amen? amen. So that's the anointing materials I want you to grab hold of that opportunity, but you need to understand it by faith. Amen? Mm -hmm. You need to understand it by faith. You need to do as you say comes by faith. Mm -hmm. Amen? So you need to grab hold of it by faith. And so is the one-on-ones with Prophet Graham Williams. If you'd like to see the man of God one-on-one with him, if you'd like to engage with him, you need to do it by faith. They have one of ones with Prophet Graham Williams. So go tell your friends, your families, those who are too shy or too embarrassed or too busy to be in the service here on a Sunday. Tell them that they can join the man of God one on one, set up an appointment, and he will come and pray for you. Amen? Amen. Is the, are, you pay, are you sowing? But there will be a seed to be sown, and that seed that you will be sowing into um, the into a, the anointing materials as well as the one on ones. It is not a seed that is what the uh, material or what you get is worth. Amen? That is not what it is. That's why it's a seed. It is a seed. Amen? So these things are to be understood by faith. But I want to encourage you all, if you don't know what I'm speaking about, you want to know more about it, you don't have a crossover service is a new year's Who wants to step into the new year with my God? Who wants to step into the new year with my God? Amen. We are planning a mighty service. I want none of you to miss out. I want you to join us on our social media platforms and get into our announcements, the things that we say there, because we will announce um, soon, shortly, where it will be taking place. But I want you to prepare yourself. Amen. Mentally, emotionally, physically, financially, let your husband, your children, let your household know that we are going into the new year with the Lord. Amen. And no one is to be left behind. We don't want to let no one remain behind. That is the heart of the man of God. Amen. Hallelujah. So I want you all to be excited um, for what is to come. Fight Watch today is moving. We are moving, but we don't want to move without you. We want you to come with. We want you to come with. You are part of us. We are part of you. We are moving. And I also want to encourage you. If there's anything you want to do to get involved in the services, if you want to get, if you want to help usher, you want to help with the media, you want to help be a worshiper for the Lord. If you want to help doing anything, come and speak to me, please. We really love for all of you to be. I want you to just open your heart to receive from it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. If the worship team can just come. I want you to receive them. Don't listen with your physical ears. Listen with your spiritual ears. Worship with your heart. Hallelujah. Let us give them a hand.
en uh, accountability en verantwoordelijk verantwoordelijkheid oh my god verder gaan dit soos met een man wat op reis wil gaan en die selfde profijt gemaakt alhoewel die bedrag in die selfde was hier 
Mr. Freedom of the Ukrainian. We were what they said. We were what they said. We were what they said. Maar die schraaf had ingekreed en de gat in die grond gegraven en zijn enige geld daarin weggesteek. Vandaag. Na verlang tegen die ene van die slaven teruggekom en hulle reek van hulle rekenskap gevraag. Je moet rekenskap gee van dit waar je God jou toe vertrouwen. Wie hoor my? Sê dat is my verantwoordelijkheid. Sê, ek moet rekenskap gee. Rekenskap gee. Rekenskap gee. Rekenskap gee. En dat die aarde gaan kom met 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 sekere gaves. Met die papas, met die doeinde. Met sekere geestelike gaves. Talente. Dat is een verantwoordelijkheid op jou. Oh my God. You didn't come into this world. You are not a biological error. Or a genetic mistake. You have a preordained purpose. You must reckon with God. Say, "Yah, give me granada." Hmm. As can you see, we come in this one. The end of five hours, man, is that we will find it. Ah, let's now stop. Na lang te leter ga kom een rekenskap gevra. Die ene wat vijf gewoon mensen kan ontvangen, kom toe en breng die andere vijf samen die meer. Die manier, vijf gewoon mensen die het hier mee toevertrouwen hier is. Hier is dit met vijf anderen. Ik heb de wens gemaakt. Zeg maar hier moet ik de wens gemaakt. Je leven zal wens maak vandaag. Dat die macht daar genoeg van die hier. Wie gewoon mij van nog aan? As jy volgende aan die tyd op die selle plek is geestelik, emotioneel finansiele present wens maak, en jy kan al jou van jou leven as nou iemand wat my woon hy is vir hy drie mense wat my glo maar ook mense wat hy drie is genoeg ek kan my nie vermaak nie ek is gewoon vir drie mense vir vir tien jaar het ek verbinder as tien
If you fear failure, you will never grow and expand. The Bible says, do not throw away your confidence on your boldness. Why do you think God is satisfied? 